I get asked the question quite often how long the electric range on my Chevy Volt lasts and so I'm going to go over that real quick. This is a 2011 Chevy Volt which is the first Chevy Volt that came out. They ran this generation of the Volt from 2011 to 2015 and then in 2016 they came out with a second generation Volt. So just give you a real quick overview of this Volt. This has got just over 72,000 miles on it. So we'll pull that up real quick here. You can see in the bottom right, it's got 72,388 miles. So it's seen quite a bit of use. Um, if we go to this guy, it shows you uh, the total mileage, 72,385. Uh, so that was set just shortly after buying, or after the car was brand new. Um, the average lifetime is 248.8 miles per gallon. So this car has been run primarily on electric over the course of its life. Um, it's only used 292 gallons of fuel. So the engine's seen some use, but the electric has obviously been used for the majority of the miles. So um, given that, that it's been used quite a bit on electric, this will give you an idea also of how much the um, battery life has diminished or not. So <clears throat> when I turned the car on this morning, I had 31 miles of range shown on the indicator. You can see that we're down down to 15 miles. Now if we come down here, this little leaf button, if you push that, that will show you the power flow information, um, charging information. So if we were to plug into a standard outlet, it'd be fully charged by 615. And then if we go to energy info, <clears throat> these are the stats um, since it's been driven today. So you can see that we've got 21.2 miles of electric range. Again, we had 15 over on this side. So even though it read out that I had 31 miles of range when I drove or turned it on this morning, we've actually managed to get um, 36.2 miles. Or we're, I guess we would be at 36.2 if we got 15 of additional electric. Um, there's also a good possibility that since that's only gone down by 16 miles on the gauge and we've gone 21.2, uh, we might actually be looking at more than that. So the 2011 volt is rated at 35 miles of electric range. So you can see that even though it's got 72,000 miles on it, the battery is actually still um, almost fully functional as far as the range. Now the main difference that you'll see um, with the volt um, and its range is the type of driving and the temperature. So you can see right here, we're 48 degrees outside. So um, a little on the cold side, but not too cold. And so at this uh, temperature, it's not gonna have a huge effect on the mileage, but once we start getting down to really cold temperatures, like 20, um, 20 degrees or less, then you're gonna start to really see that range diminish. Usually what I'll see is about 25 miles of range when it's really cold temperatures. Um, likewise, when it gets really warm outside, um, that that range of, uh, oftentimes jump up to 40 or 45 miles of electric, and so we can get a lot more out of that. Now, a couple of the other things I wanted to note is, depending on the drive modes, there's three drive modes. When I press that button, you can see up here we're normal, we've got sport mode, and we've got mountain mode. So. Keeping it in normal mode, you're gonna get the best range. Sport, it's gonna be much more aggressive. Same with mountain, it's gonna use more of that energy for climbing, and you're gonna use a lot more range. Um, these spots where the Volt really shines is if you're going somewhere in the range of like 20 to maybe 45 miles an hour, you're gonna get really efficient uh, use of that battery mileage. Once you start getting up to like 55, to 75 miles an hour, um, that range is gonna really diminish a lot quicker. You're not gonna get that full range out of it. Um, and then likewise, if you're doing a lot of mountain driving, um, climbing a lot of altitude, you're not gonna get the range there either. Um, on the other side of that, if you've done a lot of climbing, when you drop back down, the engine will be able to run a little bit to build up some electricity, and then the car will just be able to coast downhill, shut the engine off, you can run on electric, and sometimes it will actually give you a few additional miles of range by the time you get down to your normal elevation again. So kind of gives you an overview of the range on the Volt. Um, like I said, not a whole lot of difference from when it was brand new as far as how long that range lasts. 
and um, you know typically get somewhere between about 25 on really cold days up to 50 45 or 50 on warm days so kind of an overview there for you uh, if you have any questions leave them in the comments below